Hello, I'm Dr. Kim from Jeondong National University Hospital, Jeonju, Korea. First of all, it's my great honor to have a chance to talk about our paper. Let me introduce our study. The aim of this study was to evaluate the effect of aging on neurodynamic parameters in women with stress urinary incontinence. In men and women, Profound structural and functional alteration in the lower urinary tract occur in association with aging in elderly population. In Korean EPIC study, overall prevalence of LUTS was 61.4% and the prevalence increased with aging. Among the symptoms, urinary incontinence was reported by 28.4% of women and the most prevalent type was stress urinary incontinence in women. The result of previously reported studies are based on questionnaire analysis. Knowledge for age-associated change in neurodynamic parameters in women is lacking information. Thus, we analyzed age-associated change in neurodynamic parameters in women, especially in patients with stress urinary incontinence. We analyzed the UDS of patients with urodynamically proven SUI between March 2008 and July 2014. Methods and units of UDS conform to the standards recommended by the International Continence Society. UDS were performed preoperatively by single expert in an exclusive urodynamic room intended for quiet and protected from unnecessary interruptions. UDS were consisted of Euroflow metry, followed by system metry and pressure flow study, and conducted interactively with the patient. Non-instrumented Euroflow metry was conducted when patients feel a normal desire to void, and catheterized PVR was made. In Euroflow metry, Qmax, time to Qmax, voided volume, and PVR, and system metric data including first strong desire to void and VLPP were measured. Also, Qmax and detrusor pressure at Qmax of pressure flow study were analyzed. The bladder contractility index was also calculated. The urodynamic perimeters were analyzed and compared between the age groups. A total of 625 patients enrolled in the present study. Patients' clinical characteristics are shown in Table 1. QMAX in Euroflow metry and PVR were significantly different between the age groups. In filling system metry, the first desire to void was significantly different between the age group. In pressure flow study, PDAT at QMAX and BCI were significantly different between the age groups. QMAX and PDAT at QMAX were decreased, and PVR was increased significantly with age after 60 years. Okay, to our knowledge, this is a first report of age-associated change in neurodynamic parameters in Asian women with SUI. In conclusion, older women with SUI also have worsened voiding function with age as a result of neurodynamic parameters. Detroit's contractility was decreased after 60 years which is important to consider when evaluating and operating on older women with SUI. Thank you for your attention.